Great. Are we having fun yet? Is this fun for you? Because I don't like insulting my friends. But I'll do it. Just for you guys. Um, with that, let me bring up another very good friend of mine. Uh, Mr. Tom Wong. He's a senior. He's graduating. Hey guys, how's it going? I've been uh, honestly very apathetic recently because like you mentioned I'm a senior and I don't know, I've just like honestly I've just been bumming out for the past couple weeks. There's just one week I actually skipped like every single day of class, all five days, and I've been aiming just to like stay at home. And it's just kinda of sad because I like when I'm at home, I just really am at home. I'm just naked, just eating bags of shit. It's just, it's honestly kind of gross. The only key takeaway is that, like, my roommate has, like, recorded everything of it. Like, he takes, he films the photography class, and he <laughs> just takes photos of me just, you know, wearing bras, like, just doing all these sorts of different things, and I was, I was really embarrassed, and I didn't want it to, like, actually happen, but he said he was going to post it online, and I was really scared, but then he said that, you know, he actually dropped his class, so he can't actually post them online anymore. And honestly, I was actually really bummed out then, because they're like my baby, you know. Like I want, I want to see those photos, that those pictures of me just, I don't know, pouring cornflakes, just sprinkling them across my body and stuff. <laughs> um, this is actually very true. Um, if you're my Facebook friend, you would know this. Um, this is how bummy I've been recently. Just yesterday, I had, I had an exam today, and I meant to like cr cram for it. Like I really did. And the thing is, like, as a senior, you can't, you can't even, like, study anymore. It's just really, really hard. Instead of studying, like, I just decided, like, put on, like, videos of just, like, oh, what was that? Well, one was, like, a girl just, like, wrestling at McDonald's. And while I was doing that, I was just, like, in Adobe Illustrator, just drawing a guy far in my face. And it, it was just, I don't know why, it's just, this is just more fun than, like, marketing exam, I guess. Like, <laughs> I told my interviewer that like patent marketing is like my passion, but honestly, like guys sparring my face, yeah, that's my thing. Um, fun fact I learned this week: uh, Indigo actually opened in the right the heart of the recession, and honestly, that's kind of cocky if you ask me. Like, like I guess Indigo the nightclub they just thought like Penn State, you know, they just like love drinking so much. That even though their, their families are just crying about financial difficulties, you know, they'll still pay a $5 cover and $20 to go right in. And you know what? They proved everyone right, okay? Penn State really love alcohol that much. Um, <laughs> and it's just, it's just kind of silly because I don't even get, like, how that happened, but good on them. Um, so, okay. There's this thing that I really hate people do, which is, like, talking about sexual experiences. And... My roommate like does this, and it's just like he goes into excruciating details, and I just really hate it because it's like I watch, so <laughs> <laughs> like, I don't know why he's just like telling this to me again. Like I'm people, okay? Like I get it. <laughs> I should probably tell him. Like I don't know one of these days, I guess. Hmm. So um, I checked in with my. Uh, with my uh, cousins this week, actually. And, you know, that's just like doing something you have to do when you're in college, you know, just check in with like, your good family members. And uh, I, I found out that my cousins are like, doing really well. Um, one's 12 and one's is nine years old. And, you know, he's just a very supportive older brother to my um, younger cousin. He's told him, you know, you gotta keep doing your homework, even at this age, because, you know, when you work hard, you play hard. And, like, I, don't, I guess that's like, kind of cool, but I don't know if I like that advice, because, like, what's play hard for a nine-year-old? <laughs> like, when I think play hard, you know, I think, of, you know, in college, it's, you know, you go out, you party, you get wasted and stuff. So, like, is that, like, for a nine-year-old, is that, like, laser tag, or? I guess, like, if I find him, like, go to a local college and, like, you know, die from cocaine, I guess, like, well, he worked hard, like, uh, <laughs> he deserved it, honestly. <laughs> Very productive Asian little boy. <laughs> Man, this sucks, like, graduating. It's imminent. There's just, 
it's just other stuff to do. Um, and honestly, like one of the things I've been doing is just, I don't know, like I said, bumming out. I've been watching a lot of movies. And watching movies is kind of cool because you start to like, pick up trends. <coughs> and one of these things that I noticed that recently is just, I don't know, you ever like notice in Russian like, movies, like when a Russian enters the room, like shit's always about to go down? It could be anything, just like, I like a chill party scene, like a guy's like, hey man, how's it going? Like, what, what are you up to? Like, how's it going, man? And then like the Russian guy's like, hello, nice to meet you. My name is Dimitri. And then like five seconds later, like Dimitri is butt raping everyone at the party. Like, how did that happen? I don't, this is kind of gross, but yeah, lots of cool movies. They're indie. That's why you haven't seen them before. <laughs> yeah. I'm just gonna watch these guys now. Um, You're doing great. So I, I bought a lot of toilet paper recently. <laughs> and that was right before the show, guys. I'm done! <laughs> no, Tom, you stay. <laughs> Not getting away that easy. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> You saw how this works, right? <laughs> how do you explain it again? No. Okay. Remember what like, Angie said, You see, I thought so, but then you kind of ran off the stage. <laughs> okay. Sean looks like puberty only hit his face. <laughs> and last one for you, buddy. I hate... Okay, you wrote Tony. I told you it was Tom. That's fine. I hate Tom talking about sexual experiences, too. I'd like to see Tom's internet history. Tom with a baby? Yeeks baboo. <laughs> <laughs> Tom naked and eating bags of chips sounds like my kind of porno. <laughs> Tom's shoes are too aggressive. <laughs> Bring back the my wife guy. Yeah. <laughs> Woo! I checked in with Tom's cousins this week and they don't want to see Tom anymore. <laughs> Tom doesn't like talking about sexual experiences because he doesn't have any. Yeah, that's me. <laughs> the internet is a big place, and nobody no, and, uh, blah, blah, wants to see those photos. Tom is wearing a bra right now. No? Nope. I'm not. Okay. Matt said Tom was doing great, but he was lying. He wasn't. <laughs> Tom looks like the kind of guy who has tried to suck his own dick. <laughs> This writing board gave me a splinter. Honestly, the show is not worth it. <laughs> Tom Long's mouth is so big, I don't have a joke. I just want the audience to look at it. <laughs> so mean. Tom breaks the stereotype that Asians are supposed to be smart. Did you hear that guy talk? What a fucking idiot. <laughs> Thank God Tom Long is graduating. He's the worst, and I hate him. <laughs> Andrew Moore keeps using this computer to look up porn. <laughs> Tom, you're a pervert. Hey, peeping Tom. <laughs> I get it now. Tom seems like the kind of guy who has never seen cocaine. I, I have. <laughs> Alright, get up for Tom, everybody.